Now, it depends how your data is changing. In this first example, I have the sales for our product for January. And we have the product and the sales for each item here. And so how I am going to put a graph on here is I'm going to select my data and I'm going to go Alt F1, which is the shortcut to put your standard issue um, chart up here. And so there you're there, it's perfect. Now, February comes along and you would like to also include the February figures in this graph. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to enter the figures for February, which I already have here. Now, I'm going to go back to my sheet and I'm going to put them in here. But I'm also going to, when they're still selected, I'm going to select the chart and I'm going to go control V again right on the chart. And there your data is uh, is plotted again in here. You can, um, of course, add a legend on here to uh, so you can different, differentiate between January and February. But same thing goes for March. You could do the same thing for April, and you could keep going this way. And each month, when you paste it right on the chart, it will include the chart that you are doing.